Hello, everybody. Happy Sunday. Um, I wanted to talk about something. I wanted to talk about August Astina. Uh, I'm not going to be reacting to him. I want to talk about something that he said, basically. Um, basically, I want to just talk about something. So, I want to talk about... First, I want to say... Happy Sunday. Uh, happy August 25th. I want to start out by saying that. Um, then I want to start out by saying... Uh, I don't know why people comes out to the world on being gay in the LGBTQ. Because that only makes certain people talk. Okay. He was sitting there saying that he waited on God. God brought him somebody into his life. And he was talking about, you know, how God accepted him for him and accepted the guy we with. I want to say something. I think we get Christiana messed up. Now, I'm not saying what we do is right as far as when we come to talking about God and get and being gay. Because I'm not saying that from what my understanding is, you know, I'm not all in the Bible. Excuse my hand, y'all. I'm just trying to wipe off my uh, laptop. I'm not all in the Bible. From what I understand, in the Bible, it says it is a sin to be gay. That's what it says in Revelation. Now, you can go back and you can read what it says. But what I'm saying is, what gives you right to judge another person? You understand what I'm saying? That's what it comes in with me. And I was sitting there thinking, I was saying, well, when I get well and I be able to get out of the bed, the first thing I wanted to do was go to church. And I said that I was going to church for God. I wasn't going to church for nobody else. I'm going to church for God. Because a lot of people don't go to church, poor as the gay people don't go to church because of other people and other people be talking about them. Well, you're not going to church for them. You're going to church for God. You're going to church to serve your purpose in God. You're going to, going to serve God. You're going to give praise to God because you're going to thank God for you being here. You're going to thank God for just waking up to see another day because I was saying to myself today, I was just looking at to the point to where uh, here I am sitting here complaining. I was sitting here complaining about me not walking, being depressed, where God saved me. You know, God gave me another chance. It wasn't nobody else that gave me another chance. It was God that gave me another chance. I, um, when I broke my neck and uh, my nerves was damaged, God said, okay, you may be in the bed for three years or you may be in the bed for four years, but I'm still giving you another chance at life. I'm still giving you another chance to get it right. That's all I'm saying. Here, you know, I was just like, <laughs> look, y'all, I'm not here to talk about nobody. I'm not here to downgrade nobody. And that was one of the things that Akbar said. You know, the one from Love and uh, Hip Hop Atlanta. She was sitting there saying she wasn't judging August Austina, uh, she uh, for being gay. She said she was talking about 
God wasn't the one to, to bring him to God. People need to stop. That's number one. People need to stop because you don't know what God did. Even though it is a sin, you still don't know what God did. You don't know what kind of relationship that he got with God. Whatever kind of relationship he got with God, hopefully and prayfully, he got a good relationship with God. Because, child, we living in times where people don't respect each other, don't respect each other, don't care about each other. We living in in in, in race r racist times. Look how Donald Trump talks about Kamala Harris. These white people go on TV and talk about Kamala Harris. You know why they talk about her? Because they don't want her to be president. And then they sitting there saying, it's some people going to vote for Donald Trump, but everybody's not going to vote for Donald Trump. Right now, Kamala Harris is in here. You know, that's basically what I wanted to talk about. I'm not too much reacting to this uh, about August Stina and uh, I basically just wanted to talk about you know he came out to the world and but what I didn't understand I was trying to I was kind of confused because I had kind of thought in my reality uh huh he had came out before I ain't already thought he came out but he speaks on his new relationship and he speaks on um uh, his boyfriend. But that's not what I wanted to talk about. I didn't want to talk about him and his boyfriend. I wanted to talk about God. That's what I wanted to talk about. How he said God was the one that brought his boyfriend to him. And some people asking the question, do we feel like or do we think is that true? I don't know if that's true, you know, because I didn't sit down with that young man and talk about or talk the same relationship that him and God have. He could have sat down and talked to God. So I don't know about his new found relationship. I mean, everybody got their own special kind of relationship with God. I just know me, myself, just thankful for being here because of God. That's all I wanted to say, y'all. I love y'all. Happy Sunday, and y'all take it easy.